Fit like Abdi, Danny Boy here, and welcome back to another episode of Transport Fever on the USA map. We're following our latest edition, the Canadian National uh, Bulk Liquids Line. It's got nothing on it, but on a plus note, uh, the other industries, or sorry, the oil fields have started producing the oil wells. So it will be going back with crude, hopefully it'll get some fuel and we'll start getting some goods up here in Canada. Now today I'm going to get the other Canadian National Mikado we have sitting in uh, the depot and we're going to transport some mail. Now I have set up the mail routes uh, so they are going, now I've set the trucks up, they will deliver to their respective uh, truck stops at the station. And I quite actually, I actually quite like this little bit here, where they cross over, because you get a good mix of freight and passengers. There we go. Now I have connected these all up with highways. Uh, Montreal is now connected to Buffalo, Boston, and Bangor. Toronto is now uh, connected to Buffalo. Now that we've got highways, have been unlocked. Uh, they've been unlocked for ages, but I just felt that this was the time, 1925, to get them rolling. So we've still got a lot of places that need connected up, but when we do work in their area, we'll get their highways set up. And this, the flashing pain in the ass box at the top, will disappear. Now, these guys had crude, or did have crude. There was a crude awaiting. Ah, oh, three! Waiting to go to New York. Halt. Production is coming up. Uh, once it reaches its limit. Its limit is 3. Th Potential is 252. Try to ship more crude oil. Which is nonsense because... There's only two sitting there. <laughs> so... Hopefully it'll start to ship more crude. Uh, this one, the same. I think this one is slightly better. It's at 248256. Uh, details 212. There, are, there will be high demand for crude when the time comes. You've got two of eight. There is one sitting there. Nice. There's another one sitting there. I did add 10 more trucks to this line because they've got a hell of a distance to go. But we're going to get mail running. If you look in Toronto, there's a post office here. Whoa. Slight lag going on there. Post office there. Uh, the mail trucks should be on their way. Now they are in yellow. There they are. They're at the post office now. Which is fine. Now we don't have a train to run mail. But we're going to run the train to go through Toronto, Montreal, uh, from Bangor. And we could possibly continue it on hang a left and go to Detroit or Chicago. I don't know where the freight stations for these cities are going to go yet. Yet, I might add. Here's our electric train, our only electric train. I like this thing. Uh, it was mentioned in the comments that obviously power rating is poor. Because we've got four of these being uh, transported by one of them. Now, overview, does it get a full load? If it does, I will add another uh, another power section to it at the back. It does get a full load. Okay, so lots of people want to go from... Uh, Pittsburgh to Detroit. Right, let's get replacement. Now all we're doing here is uh, at the end uh, let's go to buy vehicles. Multiple units let's go all electrics. One of these at the back now it does sort of kind of fit but we'll go to replace now the power unit also carries passengers as well that may bring the power rating up to mediocre. I want to just check this. We'll fast forward it till we get to 1926. 
I did have a brief look at the airports. Nothing new seems to be happening there. You're at 90 of 90 as well. We'll ride on board with our electric Pennsylvania railroad train. <laughs> it looks pretty cool, actually. I'm assuming the driver just sits right there. I can actually see his arms flailing along there. Very nice. It's good that these power units also carry passengers as well. Right, we're in a new year. Ooh, we've got the class. So we've got the class 412. What? The class 9000. That's what we're going to go with. Uh, I do believe these numbers, like four little wheels at the front, 12 in the middle, two at the back, ah, two here. And then the tender obviously doesn't count. And we've got the Studebaker taxi, which I'm going to get rolling to some of our airports. Well, we've only got two airports, but we will have more shortly. We're going to get the Milwaukee uh, EP2. God, I keep forgetting what that train is. But the Milwaukee Railroad uh, electric goods train. We're going to get that rolling. I'm assuming it's a goods train. It looks like a heavy beast. Uh, this upgraded and now carries 108. And it got 108 first time. How does it look? No, it looks good. There we go. It's power rating is still... It's mediocre. There we go. So it should get up to decent speed. Uh, what is this? Great Northern Intercity looking good. So we've got another freight train. We don't have something that's blisteringly fast. Uh, that's okay. I don't mind. Now I'm thinking... This mail is going to continue on. And go to Detroit. Now, how would one get freight in Detroit? One asks. Now, I'm thinking, this is all good in here. These tracks may have to come out, and this might have to get deleted. Could put it over this side, but it means trains would have to embark on a wild journey. There's a lot of uh, things to deal with here. Let's just have a look. Right, freight. Now, obviously, Pittsburgh's going to need a freight station as well. I was hoping to get that in here. So let's see what our choices sort are. Let's give it eight. 800 and... 200. I thought I'd crashed there. It was just taking a long time to load that. Uh, it will be laggy as hell as we try to place this. Uh, this will be a monster size station. Oh yes, very large. Very large indeed. Alright, spin it around. Unable to align terrain. That's okay, I'm not done with you yet. Now the thing with these stations is they're so big, you have to place them using the eye in the sky quite high up so you can actually see now I will put this in at an angle if that helps so spin it around that way again around there I get ooh see that works now it is rather close to the passenger line so I'd like to bring it back slowly very slowly I mean, it looks hell of a flat over to the left of Pittsburgh. Or does it? Like over here? Ooh, see, it goes there. Uh oh. Right, push escape. Let's have a look. Yes, it is relatively flat over here. Okay, I do like flat. Let's bring the station back up. It's gonna be laggy as hell. Right, let's just make it 
400 meters. Just to sort of defeat the log. Right, there we go. Still logging, but it's okay. Let's get it orientated in a position where I think it will work. Now it's saying unable to align terrain even at 400 meters. Which is bad. Very bad. Now it says it will go there. Right, place that there. 400. Unable to align terrain at 400. Let's go back in and find our magical smoothing or flattening terrain tool. There it is. <coughs> right. Give me two. And two. Right, that's quite a large section. Okay, right. Push escape. Give me the bulldozer. Delete that. Yes. Uh, yes. Give me... Terrain tool. Now this... Should all... Flatten to an extent... Round the back of here. And keep going, keep going, keep going. Right. Should be enough length in there to get a thousand meter station in. It would have to come round and go... I'm thinking about putting Chicago's down here. I mean, I could flatten the terrain there and see about getting it in there. Wow, there is quite a large hill there. But it will flatten. Right, so this hill is proven to be challenging, but I can break it down one little section at a time. And then maintain the flatness over here. Losing a lot of trees. That's okay. Trees can be replaced. Alright, we're slowly getting rid of this hill. Now, bulldoze all this gubbins. Oh my god, so much clicking. Click, 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 click. There we go. <clears throat> Floating rock there. Awesome. Now I could put an incredibly large freight station in here and this could serve as both Detroit and what do you call it? And I could stick another one over there. Right, plan is forming. Right, give me rail. And this should be at 400 meters. Now we want this sort of relatively in the middle. Spin it round. Gonna make this one. Now we've got 8, and 8 is 16. Can I not just get 12 tracks or something? Yes, I can. 8 plus 4. Alright, there we go. Get you sort of relatively in the middle, closer to this side. Perhaps there. Right. Let's upgrade you. So you will go to 600. No problem. Let's try 800. No problem. 
Now, a thousand's gonna be our limit, so let's see a thousand. Unable to align terrain, yes. So we're getting terrain collision over here at this side, uh, which is not surprising. So I'm thinking 800 for this one, uh, 200 and 600. Uh, Katanari, yes, because we may be running the Milwaukee class along here. Station design, let's go both. 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 Let's go apply. Right, that worked. Uh, let's get another one down in here. Uh, let's spin it round, but let's just make you an 8. <clears throat> uh, that's 8 and 8. Let's just go to 0. Alright, let's get this one centered as well. Boom, fire you down there. Tannery we will leave on. Let's go for 600. I need that. Uh, move this to the side. Move that to the side so I can actually see it. So 600. Good. 800. Also good. 1000. Good. Apply. Yeah, good with 1000. Right, so they are in. Uh, we will need to do a rather large amount of smoothing around here and at the other station, but that's not actually doesn't look too bad. Uh, we need to delete these rocks. So let's get rid of them. Bye, 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 bye. Just the rock, please, not the station. Since it took me so long just to get the sucker in. Now, we'll get... Ooh. We'll apply. Right. Main Street. Let's get both. Let's get both for this. Ooh, that actually works. Let's get both for all. And apply. There we go. So, a thousand meter station there. Can't believe that actually worked. Let's connect it up with a road. Medium country road. Let's fire you in there. Alright, that is super duper magical, amazing. Uh, if you can go along there without hitting that steel mill. That would be nice, and come along here without hitting that steel mill. That would also be super amazing. There we go. Okay, so that's that sort of done. Uh, I've actually still got some stupid rocks to delete here. One there, saw it. Eagle eye, you see. Right. Now get the smoothing tool out, clean up around these edges. And there, make this pretty again. We lost a lot of trees, but that's okay. Right, now we will have to connect this to somewhere, lest the game starts complaining instantly that we've destroyed it's uh not destroyed let's bring this over to the left a touch are you connected to anything you are connected to philadelphia excellent now i'm thinking 
can float along here. Uh, maybe get some street for this. <coughs> Excuse me. Large historic street. No, I went medium street. Right, let's see where if there's somewhere where I can connect that. Right, you don't want to go into that junction. You will go into this one. Don't want it sort of interfering with the tracks. Not too high a bridge. Okay, let's go up slightly. Up. Keep going up. To there. Then go all the way across to there. Bridge me up, please. That's a bit strange. That is strange as well. But what we'll do is we'll take that there. We shall bulldoze this and that. Possibly that too. Then we'll go from here up to there. Right, that's a lot smoother. And then what we'll do is we'll bulldoze this section on that little bit. Which is slightly better, or is it? Now if I go bulldoze that as well and just go to there right that's better that's more what I was needing right that is now connected we will attempt to connect it at some other places I'll maybe add street connections to this at the other side now upgrading it should not mean that you lose all your passengers, or does it? That was an old school thing in the game. Nope, we're good. That if you did that, you lost everything, which majorly sucked. Right, now you go from there to there. Now instead of doing that, give me a little, a nice little bridge. Maybe in green. Still got a slight collision. Don't want you to go up that high. I think this will work if bring that along to there maybe bring it from here over to there maybe even get rid of that house now about there should be do good in green accept that Delete that, delete that. Connect that to there. That gets rid of that stupid little bit. And we have a not too shabby looking bridge section along there. Right, I am pleased with that. I do know that we've used normal street and sort of highway at this side, but don't really mind. The construction crew had a bad day. They laid the wrong asphalt, wrong tarmac for that. Right, so that's looking pretty good. Everything can sort of tunnel under here and pop out at some point. Now there is, the freight station here is going to be a nightmare to get into. It's going to have to come round under the mountain and pop into there. Actually, that's not too bad at all. Now the real dilemma, coming from Toronto. Now is this going to serve as Detroit as well? Could have a large one in the middle for Detroit and Chicago. 
I mean, I would absolutely delete everything at this side of Chicago and get one in there. Which is a bit extreme. And this is kind of far from Detroit. It's not too far. Once trucks are better, we'll be okay. I may try and fit an 800 station in somewhere. Possibly down here. Yes, a small one. So, Detroit City is getting two stations. Oh man, this is a this is a rather large hill. Okay, move up, 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 up. Right, you will go there, but I'm gonna need to extend you. So let's place it there. Right, 600. If it takes 800, I'll go for that. Because the station's in Canada. Right, where are you unable to align terrain? Possibly at this side. Okay, don't fear. Uh, bulldoze that. Yes. Uh, give me the station again. I'm going to make it even smaller. 200. Then I can sort of throw it about easier. Right, there we go. Maybe have you this way. And slightly further up. Go there. Right, nothing waiting, obviously. We won't upgrade that. 600, 200. Right, again, over here seems to be the issue. I can't actually fix that just by going uh, skadoosh. Uh oh, can't actually fix that. Right, let's bring it up a touch. Bring it up slightly there, there, and there. So we're going to get this weird cliff thing going on. As long as I get the station in, I don't mind. Right, 200, 600, 800 even. Apply. Okay, right, that is in. I do apologize for the extreme amount of time it took me to get these stations in, but alas, they are in. Right, mail train. Possibly going to continue on. Uh, not at zero miles per hour, preferably at a speed that is faster than wind. Katanari new. There we go. You're going to head round across here on to Detroit. Right, bring those two up. Head it round there at a blistering 87 miles per hour. Now, what kind of bridge do I want for this? A nice. Well, that's not what I expected. Let's go over the steel, the box girder bridge. Uh, bridge, pillar collision, nonsense. Just go. There we go. Right, have you coming in to the right hand side there. Now, what kind of bridge have we got here? Just sort of bridging up for the climb. I actually quite like that. Let's continue on. Uh, Autosave kicking in for the win. It's not a good sign. That means I've been playing this for about 20 minutes or something. I want to get this mail line done. Right. Hello there. Detroit station. 
with your new line. Right, main line's gonna need a crossover. Because this will be as far as the Canadian mail line goes. Construction is not possible. I can guarantee you it probably is. Uh oh. Why? This is flat, isn't it? That looks quite horrific. Let's find the snap point for there. Oh, 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 had it. And we're good, see? Told you. If there's a will, there's a way. Right, this was the one on the far left. Now, crude oil may come down here, may come down here as well. In fact, I do believe we've messed this up. Not really, just continue on. Continue that on. We are going to bring all four of these lines down anyway. One's going to be a mail train, the other one, fuel, possibly. Or crude. Alright, you continue on. Now, we are going to have to delete this. And move each one along. So let's delete it as far back as there. Right, this one here. Hello, truck, please. Going into there. This one here is going into the one next to it. This one here. Going into that one on the right hand side. This one here. Come on. Come on. Going in there. Right, now Chicago Freight Station, I do believe I am going to have it sharing. Or we could have it round here. Uh, we need to get a freight station in for St. Louis. Not sure which direction that should really face. Possibly in here somewhere. want to get Chicago Airport. So that's probably going to go at that side as well. Airport for Detroit and Pittsburgh may just go in here and supply both maybe even nashville as well but right now we're focusing on mail now detroit has no access to mail as of yet uh, for this let's go both 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 i'll play there we go all right Uh, no, 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 that's extreme. I just want to smooth this monstrosity that I've created. We do like a mon- we can fire some trees in here. That will get rid of all the sort of ridiculous looking stuff that we've done. Hopefully. Uh, give me... Street, uh, in a straight line, please, to there, in a straight line to there, pop you into there, pop this out to there, relatively straight, we'll live with that, right, that's that sort of done, I could actually come up here, which would be interesting, it'll give us a nice little tunnel, Ah, oh, sweet. <laughs> there we go. Get rid of that lump in there, please, on this sort of rubbish. Smooth out that. Just realise this all looks terrible at the back here and there. We do have one or two rocks I've yet to annihilate. I do believe that's one there. It is... You floating rock, normal rock. Right, do you believe the other rocks have been annihilated by the station? Excellent. Now, we may transport crude from here. 
using the Milwaukee, I think, actually, I would like to go right along here, come along there and get Chicago Freight Station in there. And I would like an oil refinery in Chicago as well, possibly the one in Detroit. Maybe get some chemicals or something being built here. If vehicles were available in this build of the new industries mod, we'd be building vehicles in here. But hey ho, we don't. Right, let's get, so we're hung on the left. So really mail wants to come in on here. So let's set that up to start with. Now this this is probably gonna give me the same problem. No, it didn't. Excellent. Alright, let's get you there and you there. Fire on some signals. At the end of the bridge here. And there. Oh, maybe just go after the bridge for this one. No, we'll put it there. It's one of my pet hates is placing signals on bridges and in tunnels. Although with the last uh, thank you patch update, it does seem to be slightly more easier. Only slightly. <laughs> it's still something I'd rather not do. Now, Wingus and Dingus, who's using this? You're using that. Okay, so let's let's attempt some witchcraft here. I do believe the attempt will be successful. Go into there. Yay. Go in, uh, oh, come on, hello, hello, there, yay. Oh, we are junction set up there, but that fuel train may go along here. Now, I'm going to use the Milwaukee to shuttle back and forth. Yep, right, I've got a plan. I've always had a plan. Not really. Uh, <laughs> Right, these ones don't have to cross over. I'll leave that blank for the moment. That could be bad. Yes, we're gonna leave it blank. That's dumb. Oh well. Hopefully when we do it, it will know which way to go. All right, let's connect you. Possibly in the same fashion as you did the other one. Into there. Uh, give me this bridge. We'll keep the bridge the same. Is that is that at the same? It's almost the same. That'll do. All this for mail. But I like the mail. Uh, I'm looking forward to doing the season after this is going to be on every product to every city and we're going to be, mail is one of the top things we're going to be utilizing. The only problem is the map is going to be dodgy as hell because I'm going to use the island mountain map which means we will actually have to utilize things like ship and air freight and pray to god that it actually works. Uh, we are going to be playing with the money on. And I'm in two minds whether to use this build of the new industries mod or the... The finished build. There's a lot of issues with the finished build. I made a video on it. If you've seen it, you'll know what I'm speaking about. Because the game like crashed three times. For no reason. Uh, during the making of said video, which was weird. But oh well. So that's going to be a challenge. Alright, uh, line one. 
Canadian mail line. Let's get that right. Canadian mail line. You're gonna go from here on platform whatever the hell that one is. Possibly six. Don't actually know. Right. So you're gonna go we'll keep it on platform two for the moment. Uh, we'll do the signals as we go. So you sir, I'm gonna be going that way. Or that way. You can come out of both. Don't mind. You will have to stop trains coming that way and that way. And then have them going on. Right. These signals are done. Hoorah. You are going to be sharing a line with this guy here. You are going to be moving over to there. And now we need to signal up this section of the line. So, one, two, three, four, because you're going to be going in here. And this way, we've got them coming out. Nothing is currently using this at the moment, which is fine. Okay, right. Forgot to add the stations as we, as we were going along. So you went to go to Montreal. <gasps> you actually went the right way. What a genius. Right, it's in Gracie. We're getting crude, we're getting crude there. Whether we're, whether we're getting fuel or no, I don't rightly know. The mail trucks have been set up. Not in Detroit, they haven't, though. So we'll have to set those up. We'll get our own northern mail route that goes VI here as well. So, do it, basically the mail train for Detroit that's running on the northern line will stop here and not there and then it will continue on and join up with these freight lines onward to Chicago onward to Minneapolis Springfield Road don't know somewhere whatever that is it might be Billings Montana I don't know uh, alright because we've got so much gubbins Magumba on the screen just now. Get rid of that. There we go. Now I can see. Montreal. Where was that? Place. Why will you not give me Minneapolis? It was Minneapolis. I'm a genius. <laughs> My geography is so good. Right, so. Go to Detroit West on the way back. Go there. Let's make sure Platform 3 and 5. Uh, yay and nay. Right, let's make you a colour that I can actually see. Right, there we go. Right, you want to stop on there. Fuel train stopping on there though, so... Well, no. Uh, 1, 2... How was that 3 and 5? Upper Toronto platform 2, no. Go to 3 on the way down. Or go to 5 on the way down. On the way back, going on 3. Apparently it can't get from 2 and <coughs> Montreal go to 5 on the way down. Oh god, right, get rid of all this. Start here. 
uh, platform right you don't have a crossover here you will have in a second slip switch yes right going on six or five I don't really care let's say five fuck let's go six we'll push you to the far left all right continue on going into Montreal on platform four magical Upper Toronto platform 2, let's not. So you want to go in at 4. Now apparently it says it can't connect. It's because you are trying to go go to 4. Ugh, game. I swear, sometimes. Then you go in there on the way back. You swing over onto the right hand side. You continue on, you go back in through three. Excellent. Back in through three. Back into there. On three. And then you head back to Banger. Right. That is it. It's done. Thank God. Oh my god, it's so annoying. Alright, got a few trains waiting here. Do you have anything? Nyent. Got some mail. You've got some mail as well. <coughs> now, excuse me, let's get the trains rocking and rolling. We're going to get the trains rolling before we end this episode. I'm thinking four. Four quite large trains. Right, give me the depot. Uh, spin you round, Katanari, no, not currently, buy trains, let's go to Steam, now we do have the, this one, this is the Union Pacific, which is smart, Union Pacific uh, Class 9000, this is just the standard one, these are very heavy hitters. They've got a top speed of 60, so they are actually faster than our Mikado. But, let's get this going. Uh, let's get freight. Now, currently, there is a Canadian National baggage car. Which I probably should use. I've got a plan for using that. Alas, the plan for using it has not arrived yet. Uh, right, go to freight. So where the hell is boxcar? Thought I had more boxcars, but it's okay. Just pick up mail, please. Uh, right, give me your power rating. Right, we're into poor now. I want a car boost as well. Still at mediocre. Get one, two, three, and four. Set line for the first one. Did I name this? Canadian Mail. Canadian Mail line. There you go. Push play. We'll leave them up there. Let's fast forward it. So we've got a few Mikados running. There's a New York Central Lines. And the other one is just New York Central. Here's our Canadian National Mail Train. Now, Mail is set up in Bangor. It's set up in Toronto. It is set up in Montreal. It just isn't set up in Detroit. This beast will carry 228 mail. Which is ridiculous. So at some point, I may actually limit it to just one mail train. Or maybe two or three. That'll free up some vehicles. Alright, get rid of a bit of lag. It's trucks mainly that I need to 
sort of eliminate. But we'll follow this one. It's got Virginia and Truckee. Which is okay. It's better than nothing. There's a slight bump there that I wasn't aware of before. Across the road it goes. Holding everyone up, as per usual. Now, you've got a clear signal, cause, so there's no fuel train coming. That's nice. Let's actually look at a fuel train. There's a fuel train there. Hello, buddy. You've got zero. Uh, however, you're not stopping at Boston. Production is eight. That is amazing. <laughs> Right, where's the first one? When this mail train comes out of the tunnel, push plate, we'll set the next one in motion. You've got 18 crude. Amazing. You will literally be holding up everything on the line going through there. I do believe our mail train is stuck in there. That is. It'll be able to change line momentarily. And away it goes. Right, you are actually nearly almost there. Let's get this one going. Canadian mail. I don't suspect there will be any mail for this yet. Or there may be mail. Picks up very quickly. There's that one with 18, which is amazing. Although this line, we've not actually played forward that much. This line is still fairly new. There's one of its counterparts at the station there. We are getting a lot of lag. We are playing at three times speed though. Let's get rid of that. Let's just pull you up. Right. Very laggy. Don't know why. Probably because there's so much crap going on in the game. There's a lot of population, there's a lot of road vehicles. Even things like AI cars uh, use up your CPU. It's kind of frustrating. Now it looks so much better when you're going slower. I think at three times speed it just uh, the prefers not be going at three times speed. Especially if there's more than sort of three trains in one shot. There we go, fuel train rolling and let's click on you. You've got 25 so this train is getting more. I think one of these <coughs> itself carries about 25 so that's actually not that much. Not that much at all. Is there mail waiting here? Nient. Not yet. There is seven crude though. Has your production gone up? No, it's stalled out at 256. Which sucks. If you've got anything, you've got two. I mean, your potential should be massive. Potential is only 258. It's stored 58. You need to hurry up and fire crude across. This one, again, stalled out like 216. It is at zero. I am thinking that hopefully it'll go up to one soon. I mean, 12 barrels here of the old crude. No mail yet, but the line has yet to be established. I do have to get mail going in Detroit. You've come back with nothing. You're going in with 25. Uh, you're heading back. These trains have not spaced out well. They seem to have bunched up somehow. Don't know how. Mail trains en route. First one is there. I mean, these are going pretty slow, 22 miles per hour. I think it's as it's crossing this junction here. The 
these Canadian <laughs> trains are now stuck behind these lumber and freight trains. I am assuming that the next mail train is stuck in here. Alas, it is not. Bring up trains, please. Canadian mail at 46. So oh, that's heading down. Let's get the next one. Rocking and rolling. Set you on Canadian mail. We'll keep playing the game. I'll have a quick look at everything else. Production in this needs to come up. I would say details. Potential product 4304. So, a lot of potential there. Find the airport. No one to use Con Air as of yet. I did add a few more buses to this and the ones at Houston in the attempt that, although most of them are using it as a shuttle service, there might actually be people stuck in there that need to go to the airport. That was the plan. Although this bus is currently, no, it did drop off people. Yeah, 8 out of 10. Let's ride on down the highway. Loggy as hell, riding down the highway. Wow, what's so bad? Why is that so bad? I'm going to check my... Next time I run this up, I'm going to check the CPU settings and make sure everything is being devoted to transport fever. It's okay. It may be because this is not an actual in-game road. Find someone that is in an in... You are on an in-game road. Oh yes, that's better. So when it hits roads that were not created by urban games, the modded roads, it lags like hell. Let's just test that again. So here we go. People on this road. Let's jump on board with this truck. It's got eight mail. It looks okay here. Uh-huh. And it goes train in the background there. That's nice. Another mail truck heading out. Okay, so this actually does work. Okay. Weird. So we are right. Quick jaunt over to Houston <gasps> or Texas. Anybody at the airport, Texas? Probably no. You empty uh, the plane, please. Zero. Uh, go to the lines. Give me planes only. In fact, it's not in there. It's in here. 42 of 70. Two brave souls there. On the jet plane. Right, so we'll get back to mail. You still got nothing yet, but there is mail waiting here. Toronto Mail Road Delivery. Why are you not dropping it off at the station? I would like to know. Right, you've got 22. That's okay. You're heading back in. Probably to pick up nothing. You've got nothing as of yet. There is one mail waiting at the station here. So they don't want to transfer mail across. That's okay. Uh, you are the other mail train. Canadian mail line 2. Okay, that's good. We've got something. Auto save kicking in. This is, might be, this will be an extended episode today. Alright, you finito, please. Alright, you heading down with anything? Probably just mail. At one point, you'll be taking construction materials and concrete. Uh, hopefully. 
Right, I'm going to wait for this next mail train to arrive. Down here, I believe that's it there. Oh yes, good man. It's up the temple. It's not too laggy when we're zoomed out. It's just when we're zoomed in, if I was to jump on board of this. Actually seems better. Whoa, that's a severe junction. I think as it gets to this junction down here, it starts to lag like hell, yes. As we come into the city, and sort of more things are happening. It's very, very laggy. Zoom out. Select this train here. Right, however, you are there. Let's get the last one on the line. Canadian mail. There it goes. How much mail have we got waiting? We've got five now. Good, 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 good. <clears throat> 88 of 216. New York Central Lines. So we're looking okay. Uh, put back on a normal speed, please, and thank you. Hopefully we'll get more crude here. There we go. Keep high production upgrade in seven months. I think it was just taking time for the... This one should come up as well. Hopefully. Hopefully. Uh, that's going to be it for this episode. Let's jump aboard one of our Canadian mail trains. Uh, this is a Canadian bulk liquids line. Hello, Canadian Mail. Right, the first one has reached Detroit City. Which is awesome. But we're going to wrap up there. That's going to be it for this episode. As always, if you did watch this and you'd like to leave a like, comment, or dislike, please feel free to do so. And as always, if there's more you'd like to see in the future, then hit that subscribe button. I do apologize for the excessive staying la uh, station lane at uh, Philadelphia, uh, sort of Pittsburgh and Detroit and stuff. It was a tad more difficult than I thought it was going to be. But uh, we've got the mail line, uh, line up and running, so happy days. Hopefully it will start to pick up soon. And uh, we'll get more stuff done up here in the north as well. We'll get the Milwaukee Road Class EP something uh, on the go in the next episode. But that's going to be it for me. I've been Danny Boy. This has been Transport Fever on the USA map and I will catch us later.